Hello my friends, it's Nina and welcome to another try on haul. This is going to be a Yes Style winter haul. It was supposed to be an autumn haul, but it's December now. We are quite far from autumn. This is going to be an accumulation of everything I got for the last three-ish months. There might be some autumn themed stuff, but honestly, in California, autumn, winter, they're the same. Winter weather was supposed to be autumn weather and it doesn't really get too cold here. I think it's a good haul. I think you guys will find something you might like. My style is pretty simple. I like to mix and match items, so I got a lot of basics. And since it is winter, I mostly got tops as an outerwear because I need outerwear. I also have a few accessories this time, but sit back, relax. This is going to take a long time. But actually, before we start, as always, I want to give you my measurements. I am five foot seven. 0.7. I want to say 5 foot 8, but an actual 5 foot 8 person would be like, you're not 5'8". <laughs> I'm 172 centimeters tall, if that's a better measurement for you. And then my waist is around 26 to 27 inches. So most of the pants that I get are in a large, and then most of the tops I get are in a medium. Hopefully that helps. Anyway, let's get back to it. I'm actually going to start off with the top that I'm wearing right now. It's just a... I think it's called a pullover on the, on the website, but it's just this striped, kind of thin pullover. It's not like a sweatshirt where it's really thick. It's just like a nice shirt that you can wear in the spring as well. I got it because I like stripes sometimes. I used to like fun stripes and patterns and colors. I kind of became a more simple person with my neutrals and basics and solids, but occasionally I like to have stripes. It's very comfortable. Anyway, that's one thing. I'm going to start with my bottoms, I think. And by bottoms, I mean bottom because I only have one bottom. But I just have this pair of, I think they're called cropped straight leg jeans. They have a nice mom jeans fit and they have an elastic here. So it's really comfortable. I got the size XL because I wasn't really sure of the fit. It fits really comfortably and because of the elastic, it kind of just sits on my waist really well. I also did get a darker wash and a large, but I like an XL better. I can literally wear these with anything. I love mom jeans. So that was the only pair of bottoms I got. We're just going to move on to the tops now. It's kind of an unorganized mess, but we're just going to go with it. First, I have a hoodie that you might have seen in one of my vlogs. It was my productive week in my life. It was just that beige, nice hoodie. It's really comfortable. I think this was listed as a couple's hoodie. I'm not in a couple with anyone, but I got it for myself. It's this nice beige color. There's a little something something right there. There's not much I can say about it other than that it's just a nice oversized fit and it's pretty comfortable. I got it in a beige color because I don't have beige hoodies and I like warm neutral colors. It's a good hoodie. It's good for winter. Moving on, you've also seen this before. Again, like I said, this is an accumulation of everything from the last three months. You might have seen a lot of these in my past videos or on Instagram, but this is a uh, striped turtleneck. The turtleneck's really, really big. It goes all the way up here. Again, I just wanted to bring some more patterns and fun items into my wardrobe. So I got this basic black and white striped long sleeve. And you could literally wear this with anything. And since it's a long sleeve and a turtleneck, it keeps you warm. Next, you have also seen this before. I wore this at my meetup, actually. It is this color block cardigan. Again, most of these are either one size or a large. This is an XL because I wanted that oversized fit. I tend to get things in a medium or a large and that fits just right but some items I wanted to be a little more oversized so that was an XL. This I'm pretty sure it's one size. It is this color block cardigan with a sort of v-neck shape. Oh that brings me back to this topic. Again this is a very unorganized pile of clothing but under most of my outerwear I like to wear a long sleeve or a turtleneck especially in the winter and so Nina's back at it again with multiple colors of the same thing. I got a bunch of long sleeve turtlenecks in different colors. These are just a simple long sleeve. It's not very thick. It's just a right material so you can be indoors and not sweat. It's nice to wear under a bunch of things, especially because I got a lot of V-neck shaped clothing. So here is a simple white mock neck long sleeve. It's just so simple to make outfits with and it keeps you a little bit more warm. I also have it in a black color. And then I got some fun colors. I got this nice brown color. It was good for the fall. It's also good for winter. These also can stand alone by themselves you don't need to put something over it and then i got this nice blue color i think a nice mock neck just makes your outfits a little more sophisticated those are the turtlenecks that i got i'm losing track of my items next i think i'm going to talk about this little jacket right here this is a fluffy jacket this was very popular when i was in korea and i found one on yes style it has this little blue patch right here and this one is hoodless because in my korea haul i showed you another fluffy jacket but it had a hood i wanted one without a hood so i got one from yes style it's a nice 
nice Sherpa material and it keeps you warm. This was definitely a winter essential, so I'm glad I found it. Moving on, I have this plaid coat that you might have seen before. I wore this a lot when I was in Korea. And I got a lot of questions about where I got this from, so now you know it's from YesStyle. I got this a long time ago. It's just a simple plaid coat. It's in this nice brown color. It really kept me warm and it's easy to pair with outfits. I like to wear it with my turtlenecks and some mom jeans. It's really simple. And of course, me being me, I had to get it in another color. This is a good color for winter. It's just black and white. Again, nothing much about it except it's just a good statement piece. And then I have this nice v-neck sweater that you see right here. I've just been really in love with v-necks and I love these little striped accents. Again, it just makes outfits a little more sophisticated and fancy. I need to control myself. I like to wear this with a mock neck top under. And then I got that in another color. You might have seen this in another video, but I got it in this nice navy blue color. I've really just been liking the dark blues. I think it's a good winter color. Winter is definitely just about cute sweaters, so I got a lot of cute sweaters. Next, I have this plaid blazer. I wish I had some matching bottoms, but this you can wear with literally just a pair of jeans and whatever top. A plaid blazer was pretty popular when I was in Korea, and it's also just popular in basically any style. It's just a simple gray plaid blazer and it kind of has like a casual oversized fit to it so I just like to throw this over again a mock neck top and some jeans. I'm starting to realize how simple my outfits are but that's how you should live life. Just simple and practical but also live any way you want. Wear whatever you want. It doesn't have to be simple. <laughs> just have fun with what you're wearing and be happy in it. That's all that really matters. Anyway moving on I have this fun argyle? 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 Ar argyle? This argyle Am I pronouncing that right? I want to I be sure. I want to actually search this up. But basically, it's this diamond-shaped pattern. It's very common and popular. <laughs> okay, it's argyle. I have this argyle patterned sweater. This is a very fun pattern to wear in the winter, and so I obviously had to get a sweater with this pattern. It's another v-neck. It's nice and cozy. It's very soft, like very soft. And it's just a very winter vibe sweater. I got this classic cable knit sweater. It's listed as an almond color, so it's like a creamy almond color. I think a cable cable knit sweater is just an essential for winter. You can wear it by itself or with a coat over it. It's just very cozy and it reminds me a lot of winter. So a cable knit sweater is definitely something that I needed. And then finally, we just have a simple sweater vest. This is just a solid knit sweater vest. It's this nice brown tannish color. This was good for the autumn color palette. It was nice and warm, but it's also good for winter as long as it keeps you cozy. It kind of has this bottom. It has a round neck. I like wearing colored shirts under, but you can also wear a mock neck top, whatever you want. I like to wear these with with long sleeve things, but also if it's warmer, you can wear it without a long sleeve under. You can just have your arms hanging from it. Yeah. <laughs> and then of course I got it in a gray color. This is just the same sweater vest, but in gray. Wear some collared shirts or turtlenecks under. But that is pretty much it for the tops. That is everything that I got throughout fall and winter. And now I'm going to move on to the accessories because winter, I like building up my outfits with a bunch of outerwear and tops. And I also like to wear a bunch of accessories as well. I'm gonna start with my hats. I got a bunch of hats. I'm gonna start with this gray plaid beret that I got. It's a simple beret. I just think it adds a little something fun to a solid outfit. I also got the same beret in a brown color just to add some variety to my outfits. As you can see, <laughs> these kind of go together. <laughs> wow, would you look at that? I can literally look like a cartoon character with these and that's the vibe that I'm going for. I also have this beret. It's a different beret. It just has a plaid kind of lining to it, but it's also reversible. If you want a fun pop of color, you can wear the other side as well, but most of the time I will go for just the black side and there's still a pop of plaid under it. If you don't want the plaid, just kind of fold it inside and and you have a plain black beret. I feel like it's three berets in one. And then finally for the hats, I just have this. It was listed as a wine red color. There was also a black one that I wanted, but at the time it was sold out and so I couldn't get it. Now it's back, I'm gonna go get it, but I have a fun red color for if my outfit's just plain and I want a pop of color as well. It has a sort of little band on it, but I just thought it was cute, so I had to get it. So that is it for the hats and I'm going to move on to some jewelry. <laughs> Oh, my ears are so sensitive. I have these simple hoop earrings. They just have this sort of texture to them. If you want to look at it. Dang it. It is just these simple hoop earrings. I don't know. I just thought they were cute and it adds a little something special to your ears. I got them in the silver color, but I also got them in a nice gold color as well. I like to wear both silver and gold earrings and jewelry. So they have this sort of bumpy texture to them. I think it's just a little more interesting than just a simple hoop. But those are the earrings that I got. And then I'm going to move on to these necklaces. I got a bunch of necklaces. Ah, they're all tangled. No. Uh. 
Uh, what I always wonder is how they got tangled in the first place. If it's so hard for me to pull them out, how did they get tangled in the first place is my question. I don't like this. I never asked for this disrespect. Okay, so we have, this is a disc pendant necklace. I think it's just a nice simple touch to outfits. I like to stack necklaces from time to time. And then I got another silver necklace. It has a nice little square rose pendant if you can see it. You can stack these together if you want. Isn't that cute? So cute. And then I just got those two necklaces in gold as well. No! The universe is testing my patience. So how's your day going? Same. <laughs> I just don't understand the physics of this. Okay, well after literally 20 minutes of untangling these necklaces, they're finally untangled. Anywho, my eyes are dry. Oh, I'm not sure where we left off. I'm showing you the gold version. So here is the gold version of the necklace. This is a gold disc pendant necklace and then here is the gold rose necklace i think this is just really pretty and depending on the outfit if i want silver jewelry or gold jewelry got it all covered and then finally this is just the final necklace it is this coin pendant this kind of necklace is just popular and cute and so i wanted one as well all that untangling just for that <laughs> but those are the accessories that i got and that is pretty much it for this haul that is everything that i've gotten over the last three months i think it is quite the haul hopefully there was something that maybe you guys want as well I have a code and everything down in the description so you can use that for 10% off of your purchase if it's over $49 And to use the code, just put it under coupon code I'm not really sure how the website looks now, but it shouldn't be too hard to figure out But it's definitely coupon code not anything else. And that is going to be it for this video. I think this is my last video of December. Usually when a new year comes, it's not really the biggest deal for me because it's just another year. I'm just thankful that we got through another year and that we got through this decade. And let's just have a good time in 2020 as well. I think I said most of my sentiment stuff in another video, but I love you guys. And I'm glad that I got to spend 2019 with y'all. Let's just have another good year. I have a lot planned and I'm just excited. Thank you for watching this video and spending 2019 with me and I will see you in my next video in the new year, in the new decade. Bring it in and goodbye, my friends.